Number 10. Go whitewater rafting in the Cherokee Highlands. The Pixaric region of Cherokee contains some extremely steep and painful peaks beyond its meandering knolls and slumbering hamlets. It is therefore among the top whitewater rafting locations in Central America. Number 9. Swim with fish off Coiba Island. A global center for marine life, Coiba Island sits 20 kilometers from Panama's Pacific coastline. It is the largest of Panama's numerous amazing isles and shimmering schools of multicolored fish churn through the ocean waters of the island. Number 8. Sip Panamanian coffee on the estate in Turkey. Every coffee enthusiast is aware that the best beans may produce a completely enchanted experience. A cup of the black stuff is your ticket to heaven, so forget about communion wine. Number 7. Enjoy the sunrise on Panama's highest peak. Only if you're extremely fortunate can you see the both Pacific and Atlantic Ocean simultaneously at Volcan Baru, which rises from the Talmaca Mountains in western Panama. Number 6. Ride Epic Waves at Santa Catalina. Few adventurous tourists were aware of Santa Catalina in the 1970s. The news has spread that Santa Catalina has some of the Central America's most breathtaking waves. As a result, a constant flow of sun-kissed explorers passed through the isolated fishing community on Panama's Pacific coast, yet not enough to disturb the laid-back atmosphere. Number 5. Unwind in El Valle. Residents of the metropolis flee to El Valle, a spa surrounded by flowers when the heat and bustle of the capital become unbearable. Situated in the verdant slopes of Cocle province, El Valle is only two and a half hours distant from the city, yet its ambience and style are quite different. Number 4. Celebrate afro panamian culture in Portobello. In the past, Spain's transcontinental supply chains terminated at the Atlantic at the formidable bastion of Portobello. It is located in the center of Costa Arriba, a secluded Caribbean coastline that extends east of Colón. Number 3. Steep your weary bones in Caldera's hot springs. It is good to plan a recuperation day at the Caldera's hot springs if you want to engage in any strenuous hiking in the Cherokee Highlands. Numerous thermally heated pools of the mineral rich springs waters offer a calming cure for aches, pains, and overall exhaustion, with temperatures ranging from tepid to blistering hot. Number 2. Watch giant ships move through the Panama Canal. The Panama Canal, a 50 mile international shipping route that links the Caribbean Sea to the Pacific Ocean, represents the height of engineering. The Panama Canal uses a number of massive automated locks to raise and lower ships across the continental divide in contrast to the Suez Canal which is completely at sea level. Number 1. Stroll the winding street of Casco Viejo. The urban neighborhood of Casco Viejo is the spiritual center of Panama's capital. If the bustling tall banking district serves as its economic motor, once a defensive stronghold, Casco Viejo has seen significant transformation since its founding in 1673, when the pirate Henry Morgan turned the original colony of Panama City into an enormous heap of ash and debris.